Today I'm going to use Rocket League's custom tournament feature and infiltrate tournaments that people have made and see how I get on against the general population. So drop a like, subscribe if you want to see me do this again. Let's get in and see how it goes. Maybe some of them will have like cash prizes. I don't know. <laughs> right, we're going to ignore the free steal one uh, because CBA. Entry, yeah, and it's unranked to champ. I can just slot in here, join this. We got 12 other people. Probably by the time this R oh, region South America, this is going to be tough. But I reckon there'll be a couple more join because it's the first tournament there. Let's see if we can get this win. We've got the max C1. That is my ranking ones. This is perfect. This this should be a win. I'm the highest ranked player in this tournament. South America is a bit of a rip. We are using the brand new Geode decal that we got from the Accolade Series 13. We're going to go for a little double tap here. That is just not high enough. It's just going to go straight in. But this is the decal. This is the car preset we're rocking. And let's see how many people we've got in this first tournament that we can enter. It's like ranked in the sense that it's competitive, but I feel like the stakes aren't as high. You can just get eliminated. Oh, there we go. We got 15. Things you love to see. I'd rather it say bronze to champ one because unranked a little bit sus because then in theory anyone could enter. But this should be a win. Like I can sneak into a champ tournament. We've got unlimited boost. Okay. 200 ping, unlimited boost, one second respawn time. Hopefully they don't know it's unlimited boost and we can just zoom right in. I've never played a South American game before. Perhaps this guy hasn't either. It's Battle of the Ping. Bang. <laughs> it's so laggy. Let's see what we got. I'm going to bump him maybe. Okay, let's see what he's going to do here. Okay, this is free. We're going to probably see you in the second round because that was, um, that was unfortunate. But I think this will be quite an easy win against Awake Fox, who I guess is in Europe as well. As uh, it is Battle of the Ping here, and we're currently winning. <laughs> Bang! There we go. Things you love to see. No boost on the map. It's just pure carnage. I'm surprised this is... Where is the guy? I have no idea. Let's go up to the, uh, the ceiling here. It's like free play. <laughs> Look at him go! He can't let go of the boost button. Come on, lad. Okay. Well, this is just great, isn't it? This is just good, high-quality Rocket League. Let's go up again. It feels weird with unlimited boost. It feels like everything's moving a bit too fast. Right, that's a goal. 2-0. I'm probably going to see you in round two when we play someone a little bit better. Oh, yep, yeah, that's it. Just a straight up. Uh, they're gone. Okay. I definitely could have checked the mutators before I joined this tournament, but, you know, it is what it is. We're into the quarterfinals already. Things you love to see. Oh, Mbappe's in this tournament. Go on, Killian. Windless device... Are these real people? They have to be. Best of five. The finals are a best of five. Oh my days. We've got Musty. Oh my goodness. Everyone's in this tournament. I don't really like unlimited boost in games because I feel like boost management and getting boost is a, is a whole part of ones that you just obviously lose with unlimited boost and everyone just drives around like an ape and it's just, it's crazy. All right. Where are you from? Are you from South America? Hard to tell. Nope. Okay, we got more European players by the looks of things. Let's see how this goes. Bang. Okay, that was exceptionally laggy, but we've got unlimited boost. So, you know, we'll just score that. I think we're going to get to the next round. I think this tournament might be a bit too easy. Oh, he's not happy. He's not happy, is he? Say something in the chat, cold as ice. Come on. Let's see what we can do here. I'm going to try some kind of flip and put it to the left side. It's very laggy, though. We missed the ball. Maybe go for a pinch here, because why not? It just... You see what I mean? You can just fly around, like, haphazardly. Just do whatever you want. It's literally free play in a tournament. The free play simulator goes crazy. It's 2-0 already. Another swear in the chat. Wow, no problem, I guess. I don't know. Let's see how they do. It's not going to be another 2-0 forfeit after 20 seconds. So, at least there is that. Slow it down. Lovely. That's 3-0. And that is a tilting goal to concede as well. That might be a forfeit because that's just frustrating. I would not want to get scored on like that. What's he looking like? It's... Look at the state of it. Oh my goodness, the car. Okay, I guess I'll see you in the next game. This infiltrating tournaments idea was... Hang on. Perhaps not as well thought out as I, I thought it would be. Let's go up here to the ceiling and do... Oh my goodness, the lag. We'll go up to the other side then. Surely. Surely. Where are you going, lad? Fake that. <laughs> that was a nice fake. Is that going to be a forfeit? I just went through the post. The servers are not great, are they? I should do EU next time. I guess I'll see you for the semi-finals. You're going my way. I knew he'd just gonna, like miss it like that. That was just so obvious. <laughs> <laughs> well, there we go. GG's. Oh, Killing Mbappe with the comeback. And there's the tournament creator up there, potentially in the old semi-final against either myself or Mbappe, depending on how that first game goes. So we're going to be here a little while. You want to go against the tournament creator here because 
you'd like to think that he's made the rank requirements that best suit him. So he's probably champion ones, and that's why he's made it the max, so that he can have a good chance. And he's won 5-2 there. It's saying we're going back into the quarterfinals against this guy. I hope for my sake and his sake that that's not true, because we don't need to run that one back. All right, so while we wait, we actually have three drops to open. So let's get it. Rare drop number one. Come on. White Octane. Nope, it's going to be very rare. It's going to be... Ooh, okay, SLK wheels. Nothing great. Let's move on to the next one of three. Come on. Be big. That's a rare. Not good. It's going to be the Toonwood paint finish. Okay, and now the golden gift. Let's just get a little titanium white striker mainframe. This is the fourth of my five golden gifts. I didn't make a video on this one because I sort of got it before I even knew I was going to, so I couldn't record the games to get it. This is the fourth of five. Come on. We had two exotics, a rare, and then a second rare as well with the octane Christmas tree in orange. Well, to be fair, it's my favorite color for one. And my color blindness means that Christmas trees do look orange. So that's what Christmas trees look like to me sometimes. It's, it's a bit weird, but yeah, I'll take it. A little pick a pixel special. And now we wait uh, for, uh, is it Mbappe against the creator of this tournament before we play? It's not. Oh, Mbappe got eliminated. It's the creator of the tournament taking the win. So we're going to play the creator most likely in the semifinals before coming up against maybe musty in the final you never know hey there we go finally oh it's been a long time these games still going on uh seven four four two a lot going oh musty up the must and we have maxu in a best of one semi-final for a place in the best of five final i mean that is only three games if you slap someone up it might even be less if they forfeit early if they're two nil down but here we go ended up winning four three there very very close game so I'm excited to see how this one goes. Let's get in and give him a game. Let's try and knock out the creator of this tournament. That's what this is all about. Surely they're on good ping as well. Okay, decent ping. So let's see how it goes. We might just have to... Okay, that works. Don't mind that at all. Ping. That's a goal. <laughs> what a finish. Okay, so let's assess the level here. This person obviously won round one, won the quarterfinal. They're going to say anything to me. Look at this for a finish. Oh, it's top bin behavior. That is outrageous. Come on, Maxi. 2012. There's no way I'm playing an 11-year-old. Is that... Is that... That's... That's really what's happening. That's really what's happening. I'm playing an 11-year-old in Rocket League. Wow. So when I started my channel, this person was four years old. That's mental. But hey, we're 2-0 up. I think it's going to be light work. I suppose this, these are the mutators that they think is best. They've got a low-ish max rank. They've got unlimited boost, so they don't have to worry about boost management. They've got a region that sort of suits them and doesn't suit many other people. So I think this is probably the best case scenario for him in terms of winning games in Rocket League. Okay, should a challenge for that. It's very, very laggy whenever he gets involved. He's going to go for this. That's 3-0. Okay, so this is going to be a final best of five situation. 2012, the kind of temperament I had when I was 11, I will be, I would have given up very much now <laughs> I, <laughs> that reminds me i remember once the one of the most embarrassing gaming moments i think i've ever had made more embarrassing by the fact that my brother whipped out the video camera and recorded my meltdown uh was on the wii i was playing sonic and the black knight and there was a level i love that game by the way and there was a level that i just couldn't get i was just failing like i feel like they made games back in the day so difficult and i was in floods of tears and i was angry i was fuming i was crying and then my twin brother from behind the door was filming me and i had the embarrassing moment of having to watch back my childish breakdown i was like 13 <laughs> at this point so it was pretty embarrassing to say the least and uh yeah so i definitely i would have quit by now if i was this guy at that age i would not have the temperament to take such a battering and offer nothing really as, as far as competition goes because it's five nil it's only been one minute maybe i should try a high rank tawny maybe this is just the level of all tawnies i don't know if this person is going to forfeit maybe they have that childlike belief in terms of getting a victory royale but five nil it's not looking good little pinch over there it's going towards the goal is he gonna get the goal no let's try and win this tournament without conceding a goal that would be kind of outrageous bang that's a goal he just knew it. 6-0. I guess I'll see you for the final. The best of five. It's going to take a long time. Yeah, it's, it's curtains, isn't it? It just is. Winning a tournament without conceding a goal. That has to be the motive. They're already doing the semi-final and Musty is currently losing. Okay. All right, Musty, I see you. This rage guy, we had a 10-6 there. Okay. A 6-0. 
Okay, okay. We obviously haven't made a single save uh, because we haven't sustained a shot on target yet. 5 nil down. Musty's making a comeback. It's 5-3. All right, Musty couldn't make the comeback. We have the top scorer of the tournament against the clean sheet merchant that is Pick a Pixel. The final, best of five. Are we going to keep three consecutive clean sheets following these three consecutive clean sheets? It's like laundry day. Let's see how this goes. I've been in this tournament for half an hour and I've had about three minutes of gameplay. Just been waiting in the menus the whole time. It's Stadio Vida at dusk for game one of three. I'm calling it now. Clean sweep. Let's see how we do. Let's get it. Okay, he's just going to not go for the ball. That might be 1-0. Cheeky little finish into the bottom right. A good save. It wasn't going in. Let's assess the... Uh, Standard here, shall we? Maybe a demo. Oh, well, I'm dead. Get me back in the game. First time experiencing the respawn. I don't like this distance from the ball. I really don't. It's a it's a bit laggy. It's a bit laggy. I'm not going to lie. Let's go up here and uh, into the bottom left. Miss that all the way down. Don't know where he is. Going to hop up there. Good block. That could be 1-0. It is 1-0 off the post. It's possible. This is a possible clean sheet situation. We've got the markers at the top. We've had a save already. Things you love to see. Let's just try and assess what he does here. Good, good kickoff. And maybe a little cooks here pinch. That was an L. But he's up there. That's 2-0. Things you love to see. In a bit, lad. Maybe a little early forfeit. You can't forfeit this early without leaving the tournament. He's left the tournament. He's left. He's left. <laughs> he's not having that. You've just put in half an hour's hard work to get to the final of a tournament. I've scored two goals. And that's enough for you, is it? I mean, already up. But I think that's, that's GG. Did he know it's the best of five? Let You know what? I think that's it. I think we're done. I think we've done it. We've done a whole tournament without conceding a single goal in Rocket League. Phenomenal. The South American destroyer. Well, that's it, I guess. Did, did we take the win? We did. <laughs> that was it. That was so anticlimactic. First place. Best of five finals. Not a single goal conceded. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. No saves? I don't think we even faced a shot. No shots. No shots. Hang on. Did we have the perfect tournament? No shots. No shots. Okay, we didn't concede a single shot, let alone a single goal. If only we didn't offer them a single save. I think there were two saves made against us. All right, let's try another one, I guess, and see what we can find. Let's join this one. Can we join this one? Hey, there we go. We've got another cheeky little tournament we've managed to slide into. And look at the history. That's, that's good for the history. We got a first place result there. And this is a, a 10th anniversary tournament or something. It's 1v1 Heat Seeker. Ah, oh, best of three heats. This is long. All right, we're going to do the clean sheet challenge. Okay, yeah. All right. This is good. A nice little mini tournament. Best of three. Let's do it. It's Europe. It is Heat Seeker. Let's go. I don't want to concede a single goal in this video. That's the that that's the goal. But Heat Seeker is more difficult to not concede a goal because they've got aimbot. Like every shot they do is aimbot towards my net. Look at this. Bang. I'll wait. Like, look at that. That is a shot and a half right there. Heat Seeker 1v1s are just a bit long, aren't they? See what I mean? Up there. That's a good shot. That's a tough one. I knew that was going to go in. I actually aimed for that to be a good shot rather than just a touch. I, I fully hit that up and yeah, high, oh, up and down, over the wall. Oh, it's too good. Oh, well, this is just a bit anticlimactic, isn't it? Hopefully we just become such an impregnable force or impenetrable <laughs> that they just give up because they can't score. That would be great, honestly. Because a best of three heat seeker 1v1 is long. I thought this was going to be like good content, but actually it's not really, is it? I might as well be playing against the bots, like the actual Rocket League AI. That sounds really muggy of me, but no one scored. I've been playing Rocket League for 40 minutes now. Maybe I can get a nice little ceiling shot here. Nope, not high enough. But the arc is good. It's top corner. There we go. Game one winner. Is he going to stick around or is that that? Either way, the clean sheet remains intact. Here we go. We're into the final against Albert. How did their first game go? Just two nil nils. <laughs> Things you love to see. <laughs> this is it. Two nil nils. Cold as ice. We get a kickoff. So that's nice. I'm not going to touch the ball. I'll happily play this out. I don't care. Doesn't bother me. Because then if he comes forward and I score, he can't exactly do the same to me because I'll be sat on a one nil lead. I'm not going to be baited that easily. We're 30 seconds into the game. You've got to get to that center circle before I consider hitting this ball. I'm serious. The mind games. I'm not... Bro, you're barely moving out of the net. If you think I'm going to get baited by that, you've got another thing coming. I'm not going to go. <laughs> 
Oh my goodness. He didn't even try and fake me out. He's just like, right, screw it. I'm going to send it. You realize I can just chip the ball, right? <laughs> That's filthy. And what are you going to do? The same thing. I, I, go for it. I'll stay in the net. He's not going to do the same thing because he's losing. Ah, oh, he wants a proper game. That's 2-0. <laughs> he's overextended that massively. Oh, what a save. All right, we just got a free 1-0 lead. Honestly, in Heat Seeker, if you get first kickoff, just do that. Because the best case scenario for the other person is they make it go nil-nil overtime. Like, genuinely, you've got them by the balls there on that kickoff. You saw the whole thing. I just had to wait for him to leave his goal, and it's GG. He's got to be fuming from that. That is hilarious. <laughs> is it in the spirit of the game? I don't know. But you have to take possession off me. What's he going to do now? And, and see, now, like, it's not like, like I said, he can hit you with the same strategy back because he's got a lead to catch up. So it's just, it's so elite. It's so elite. That's not even a strategy I've honed necessarily. It's just logically it makes sense. If you just sit on the ball and they have to come out for you to do something, you have a free open net. It's just, it's foolproof. It's broken. I don't see a way, if you're not bronze one, how you don't score the first goal if you have kickoff using that strategy. Unless, like I said, they make it go to a nil-nil overtime and then do the same thing to you. At which point I would just not move. I'd just stay there. I'm, you know, that is the, that's the one downside is if they just don't go and you don't shoot and you stick to it and then it's just a nil-nil overtime. I, what is going on here? I'm, I'm going to have a clean sheet video, aren't I? Two tournaments, no goals conceded. Uh, maybe the standard of the tournaments is just lower than I expected it to be. Maybe the better players aren't awake at this time. They're not really kicking about here, but... I also realize now, actually, that Heat Seeker is just a first to seven situation. So we could end this game pretty soon if he keeps letting the ball go in like that. Because we had a minute of nil-nil, and now we've scored six goals since. So I'm happy with this. Let's see how it goes. And maybe he leaves before the third game. Maybe he has faith. This could be it right here, because that's tough to get back for this guy, I feel like. Yep, that's another goal. That's game over. Are they going to leave? I don't know. But that, that's GG. So are they going to say something? They're going to do the same strategy, aren't they? They're going to get kick off and just sit on the ball. I can feel it. I can feel it. No, it's me. <laughs> yeah, buddy. We're doing the same thing. I don't even care. He's going to have to try and figure out a way to stop me. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe he just goes to overtime. I don't know. I might go at the ball to the left this time so that we can try and hit it around the right. I'm getting a bit nervous just because if it does go to overtime and he gets the kickoff, he will do this to me. At which point... <laughs> Just put it round the right. <laughs> yeah, I deserve that bump. Oh, that's so funny. I looked so AFK, but I just put it round the right. It's just savage. It's savage. And now we're 1-0, and we can carry on with the game. But here we go. That is going to be the game. Nice and high. Hard to save. And that is the clean sheet challenge completed. Well played. An hour of Rocket League. And that's that. Do I feel better about myself? Not really. <laughs> hey, the champion is champion. Is real, real, real. At least we had the funny kickoff strategy. Look at that. The custom tawny destroyer. <laughs> well, that was a bit of fun. Can't say I'll be doing that again. But if you want an ego boost in Rocket League, why not give it a try yourself? Drop a like if you enjoyed. Subscribe down below to join the Pixel Army. I have been Pixel. You have been awesome. And I'll see you in the next video very soon. Flying in a missile, haters throwing shade, never pick me, not an issue. I am a beast, I'm at the top, I run these beats, I hold my spot, so stop before it hits you. It's Pekka, Pixel.